guys, so today I'm going to be sharing with you my uh, favorites from the month of April. Um, I, uh, I kind of went back to um, some uh, oldies but goodies. I went through my collection and pulled out some things that I haven't worn in a while. Um, so I figured I would share those with you as well as um, my current... Uh, loves that I'm using now um, and then some new ones so okay let's go ahead and get started so the first thing um, that I still love and it is the uh, Laura Geller spackle supercharged uh, face primer um, I love this stuff um, it it works great um, underneath uh, the next product product I'm going to talk about in a second. Um, but overall, this primer is amazing. It is a little bit pricey. I think I paid around $30 for this um, at Ulta. But nevertheless, it, it's an amazing, amazing primer. So, um, okay. And then the product that I have been uh, loving that kind of goes along with that uh, primer is the Laura Geller Baked Liquid Radiance uh, foundation. My shade is uh, medium, I believe. Um, hold on. Yes, medium. Um, and I have a full review um, on this. I will link to it down below. Um, I really, really have been enjoying this. Um, I'm surprised that I like it just because it um, has a kind of semi-matte finish. Um, but it works really well actually for my oily skin. So um, I'm wearing it today actually. Uh, and um, yeah, I just, I really, really like this. So if you want a more in-depth uh, take on this, check out the review below. Um, all right, let's see. Um, okay, something new that I have been loving is this Milani uh, Rose Powder Blush in Romantic Rose. Oh, you guys, I, I love this. This may look like a really, um, I'm wearing this today, by the way. Um, this may look like a really understated blush, like one that wouldn't come off with much color. Oh my goodness, you guys, this is freaking gorgeous. I love this. Here's a swatch. Uh, I love this this is an amazing amazing blush so um if you have not uh, uh checked this out i would highly highly recommend it it's amazing you've heard me talk about this five million times this is the maybelline dream wonder powder my shade is number 50 creamy natural um love this uh i went back to using this um just because i Felt like this gave me a little bit more of a uh, kind of like a, a oil control. Um, I was using a different finishing powder before, and this one I think works a lot better for me. The next um, thing that I have been loving, and again, this is uh, I've talked about this a lot. This is the Lorac Behind the Scenes Eye Primer. Um, I love this eye primer. Uh, there's not really much left to say about it. Um, it, uh, it, I like, I'll just say, I like it a lot better than the Too Faced Shadow Insurance. So, love this. Um, okay. <laughs> kind of back it up a little bit. Um, this is actually a new product that I have just fallen in love with. This is the Pixi uh, Correction Concealer in brightening peach. I'm wearing this today. Um, it's just a really nice salmon toned uh, concealer. Um, it works really well um, for uh, my covering up my um, under eye circles from just not getting enough sleep and all that kind of jazz. So um, really, really have been enjoying that. And the next thing that I've kind of I guess forgot how much I loved. Um, this is the Mally Evercolor Shadow Stick in Dusk. Um, this is just amazing. I love this so much. Um, hang on. 
There is a swatch of it. Um, it's it's amazing. It's a uh, it's quick if you have um, mornings where it needs to be you know minimal to no time spent. Um, this is a great great um, option for that. So been loving that and totally forgot how much I uh, was loving that. So I'm glad I rediscovered it. The next thing that I um, actually have not worn ever before. I'm kind of surprised I haven't because this is a gorgeous shade. Um, it was limited edition. Uh, you may be able to get it on like Amazon or eBay or something like that. Um, but it is the Maybelline Master Drama Eyeliner in the color Taupe Takeover. Oh, you guys, this is amazing. Let me um, get a swatch for you. Uh, I just, I don't know, it's it's a, just a beautiful, 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 I can't talk, a uh, beautiful color. Um, there it is right there. Uh, I, I love this. Um, I'm surprised that I haven't worn it, um, more, but love it. Another thing that I wore for a really, really long time that I stopped wearing, and this is the, actually one of the first palettes I ever bought from Wet n Wild, and it is, uh, Wet n Wild's trio in Walking on Eggshells. This is an amazing... Um, trio. I wore this a couple days ago. Um, I love this so much. This is great for a just natural, um, natural look. Uh, I just, I love it so much. I'm going to try and get swatches. Um, hang on. There's the swatches right there. Um, I just, I love them so much. Okay. All right. So there you go. I know this is a really bad place to swatch, but they're right there. Um, so right there. I love this palette so, so much. So um, if you have not ever checked this out, I highly suggest that you do because it's amazing and it's really cheap. It's only like, I want to say four dollars three or four dollars so next thing that I really um, I went back to after trying the uh, what was it the benefit um, roller lash mascara I have a review on that down below um, as well as hello I see you <laughs> what are you doing <laughs> Um, okay, so, uh, this is the Full Lash Bloom Mascara by CoverGirl. Um, I went back to this after using, um, the Benefit, uh, Roller, la roller Lash because I, I don't know, I felt like that mascara just wasn't right for me. Um, I'm gonna use, I am, I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm going to use it up, but, uh, I went back to this um, for now because I just love it so much more. I have a review on this mascara. Um, I will link it down below, but here's a look at the um, wand. It is significantly bigger than the Benefit one, but uh, I just, I, something about this I just love. I think it's the fact that it removes so easy. Oh my goodness, it's amazing. Um, I don't have to use any extra um, makeup remover. I can just use my simple um, cleansing facial wipes and that takes care of it. I'm wearing this today, by the way. So great, great mascara. I highly suggest you pick this up. This this product, this is the Wet n Wild Single in Brulee. This serves a couple of different pur purposes. One, it serves as a really great... Um, uh, uh, under eye concealer setting powder. Um, it's just a really great creamy shade. Um, I really, really like it. Uh, it is right there. 
um, it's it's a great great product for that and it's also great for a uh, brow bone highlight which I have it on today under my brow as well as my setting powder for my concealer so um, really really like that uh, okay and then the final final thing that I have been loving and trying to get more use out of is the uh, makeup geek eyeshadows um, I have eight of them let's see yeah so I have eight of them um, I really have been loving these uh, they're just amazing um, I uh, they're very very pigmented um, really good color payoff um, and they're cheap they're like $6.99 I think each um, so I really really like these um, a couple of my favorites it, uh, would be this one down here. It's a taupe shade and it's called Prom Night. So there's that one. Um, another one would be um, Barcelona Beach is really great. Um, there's Barcelona Beach. It's really great for a uh, transition shade um, for my skin tone. For some people um, it's good as a contour. Um, okay, and then the other one that I really have been loving is, um, this shade called, um, this one called Bitten. It's a really nice, um, Bitten's right there. It's a really great, um, purple-ish shade. Um, I, I really, really have been loving, loving, um, them so here let me stick these okay so there you go um so bitten is right there uh barcelona beach is right there and then prom night is right there so um i know really bad place to swatch but um yeah i i really really have been enjoying um using those so, oh, I feel like I've been talking for forever. All right, so I hope you guys enjoyed that. Um, thank you so, so much for watching, and I will talk to you guys very soon. Bye.